Hey everyone, quick biochemistry basics here. Let's talk about Griffith experiment. Griffith in the year 1928 was working on a bacterium known as Streptococcus pneumonia. Streptococcus pneumonia has two types of strain, smooth strain and the rough strain. Cells of the smooth strain have a protective layer known as the capsule, which protects the cells against the immune system. This makes the smooth strain highly pathogenic. The rough strain lacks capsule. Hence, the immune system can easily kill the rough strain. When the cells of the smooth strain are injected in mice, the mice is killed. Whereas when the cells of the rough strain are injected in mice, the mice survives. In the next experiment, the cells of the smooth strain were killed by heat. When these cells are injected in mice, the mice survives. However, when the cells of the heat killed smooth strain are mixed with the rough strain and injected in mice, the mice is killed. And this result was surprising. This means something was getting transferred from heat kill S strain to live R strain which converted the live R strain to S strain which was highly pathogenic. And this phenomenon is known as the transforming principle. Griffith did not know what is getting transferred from the heat kill S strain to the live R strain. Further experiments to find the transforming principle was done by Avery McLeod and McCarty. And they showed that the transforming principle was the DNA. لو عجبتك ترجمت الفيديو اعمل لايك وشير وقول لنا عشان نترجم فيديوهات تانية بنفس الطريقة باي باي